Hey Foxies, it's Simon Fox. If you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified when I upload. I upload every Sunday. And if you're returning, welcome back. Like always, this is never about subscribers, nor about money, but about love and light. So with that being said, let's get into this rainbow skull look. So here I'm just priming my lids with the Jeffree Star Concealer. I found that using this makes my eyeshadows pop and makes them look just so amazing. I love the way that it blends and everything on top. So it's like, yes, if you haven't used the Jeffree Star Concealer as your lid primer, definitely would suggest. So now taking the James Charles palette and basically doing the rainbow on my eye. I first went in with some red. Y'all can use any shade of red that y'all have, any shade of orange, any shade of yellow. Basically, any shades that you're able to get your hands on, you can use. I mean, as long as they're blendable and you're good at blending, your look should look very, very similar still. So here, going in with the orange and then the yellow. And by the way, you guys, I go back and forth between blending and packing. So, I mean, if I don't insert that, I'm putting that in here in the audio. <laughs> By the way, you guys, I also want to mention this video was requested by Ashley. Um, I did a video with her a few weeks ago. So y'all make sure to check that out because it's hilarious and it's to die for. And I suggest y'all watch it before it gets taken down. But <laughs> yeah, it's a really, really funny video and it's good. She wanted me to do a rainbow look. And honestly, it had crossed my mind, but I was like... You know, I'm not out the closet yet, so... No, I'm just kidding. No. <laughs> okay, look, the real reason I didn't want to do a rainbow look was just because I was like, it's so common, like, everybody does it. But, you know, I was just like, okay, whatever. I got out of that mindset just because I was like, look, it's a rainbow look. Like, duh, everybody does it. I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking a few weeks ago, okay, you guys? But we're here. I, I basically ended up... Still doing the rainbow look, but obviously adding my own touch to it because, like I said, even though it's something that's very common, I like to add something different to it just to, I'm extra, I don't know, make it pop. So here I'm just cutting my crease with the Jeffree concealer. And honestly, you guys, I'm not one to take tips on cutting creases, but I'm actually getting a lot better. So here I just went in and used the pressed glitter on my lid and it honestly completed the whole eye. I was obsessed. Um, ended up doing my liner off camera because honestly, you guys, I had it recorded but literally, you know, when your liner just keeps getting thicker and thicker and thicker and you're just like, okay, I guess. So here I'm just re-adding that pressed glitter and it honestly made it stand out so much more. So like I said, it completed literally the whole eye. There I used the NYX primer because I'm broke and I don't have a primer um honestly I was running out there so I don't have a primer <laughs> anyways so here going on with some CC Beauty paint I'm using their face paint and it's honestly such like good paint like it's really really good paint and I always hear that it's um like a dupe for the makeup forever one now, do I know that for sure? No, but that's what I hear. And honestly, I feel like I feel like the paint looks good. Like I feel like it looks it looks like paint. Like what else do you expect? Do you know what I mean? Like it's it's paint. Just have fun with it. So here I'm literally just using the colors of the rainbow and just painting my face, going in anywhere um I wanted to add that color. Um, I decided to use my face because I'm always saying, like, your face is literally art. Like, when I do makeup, it's literally a form of art to me. This is my paper and crowns and colors and all that. You know what I mean? Like, this is all that in a face and makeup. So, I use makeup as a form of art and I decided to illustrate that using paint on my face. 
I'm, <laughs> it's so funny because I feel like I just dumped it down for myself. <laughs> but anyways, y'all get the point. The next review I'm going to be doing is the Conspiracy palette, you guys. I've literally waited and waited and waited for this palette to come out because I've been obsessed with the whole series. I've been watching it like crazy. And I'm just so just in, in awe because I'm like, I can't wait until I make my own makeup line because that is exactly what I want to do. That's exactly why I have this platform. Like, those are my dreams and that's exactly what I'm going to accomplish. But what's so crazy is like watching it, I didn't think I was going to get so sensitive seeing everything behind the works because you never see that realness and you never see that on YouTube. And to see that, like... I was just so appreciative that there's people like that, especially on such a big platform with so many uh, supporters. Like, you don't see that anymore. Like I said, you don't see that realness anymore. So I really, really appreciated that. And honestly, I bought like a big old baby during the, the whole last series because I was just like, I know one day I'm going to make it and I know one day I'm going to be able to have my makeup line and to accomplish the things that I know that I'm able to accomplish. It's just so crazy that it just touched me so much, you know, like it's amazing that we, I'm literally starting my YouTube and I'm literally here and I don't know, it's, it's just a lot, it's a lot, but um, I'm very grateful for everybody that watches my videos. I really, really am. Um, I've had people that don't even know me support me more than people that I actually considered friends at one point. So very, very grateful. Thank you all so much. And I hope you all enjoyed this look. So if y'all haven't already, please make sure to like and comment and subscribe if you haven't, because I'm not going anywhere. I'm literally just starting and y'all are gonna see way more of me, way more progress, and just so much more love and passion put into my work. So thank y'all so much, and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye, Foxies.